The Supreme Court struck down affirmative action in college admissions. Reaction was predictably split along ideological lines, but there was disappointment at schools which had used the policy to promote student body diversity. Investigative reporter Mike Perlstein got feedback from two universities here in New Orleans, and while the reaction was largely negative, there was also nuance. I thought about, you know, the ways in which this was a blow to integration and making sure that that takes place for black people particularly and people of color generally. Andrea Boyles, Associate Dean for Equity, Diversity and Belonging at Tulane University, believes the Supreme Court's dismantling of affirmative action will roll back decades of progress toward equality on college campuses and beyond. Given that it has now been deemed not necessary to factor racial oppression in, um, this has um, consequences for all spaces. Professor Ashraf Esmail, head of the Center for Racial Justice at Dillard University, says he's at least encouraged that many universities seem determined to achieve diversity despite losing the tool of affirmative action. But it's been a positive that a lot of university presidents have come out and said, well, this doesn't you know, change our mindset or thought process in anything. So um, it may be overblown. But while encouraging words are one thing, he said future enrollment numbers will be the real test. Time will tell, and we just don't know. Dr. Esmail said that historically black universities like Dillard could see a silver lining. HPCUs now will benefit that we'll get more enrollment at Dillard and Southern at New Orleans and, and other HPCUs in the country. And Mike joins us now in the studio. So what do you think we can expect from here, Mike? Well, based on the comments that we've been getting from universities, there is still a very, very strong goal of achieving some racial diversity as well as other kinds of diversity. Mm -hmm. Now, the challenge and the discussion that universities are having is how to achieve that without straight up affirmative action. Mm -hmm. All right. Lots to watch. Lots. Thank you so much, Mike.